Hey, Lucky Sevens here. I made a ton of test decks, but this is by far my favorite. It is just efficient. It's Is It Super Friends? Called it Is It Right in the deck listing, but Is It Enough is really what I was thinking, and it turned out to be. All these one mana spells, op spell, pure shock are incredible. I anticipate all this more filtering, searches, more filtering, and Narsa and Sahili on three usually are silly. Now, you can actually win with Ral and Expansion Explosion. You can win with Eugene's just ticking up. And you can win with Sarkin. <sighs> There's other cards I was thinking about getting, like Ogre of Bolas, and I still haven't really put a sideboard in, so you know it is what it is but there's so many things i want to try uh as a side note i did put in star of extinction for a later date um that's about it everything else just stays the same i'm i'm probably gonna also put in another expansion explosion but we'll get those things as we get the cards all right first hand good you want a one drop hopefully we can kill like and I don't know some elf some land war elf if not we're gonna get Narset later uh, it can hold up expansion to you know do a thought erasure when they do a thought erasure uh, you know well, however we do this I think we're looking good all right so we want to hold up expansion explosion so we'll do that um, on curve we'll do so for falls after we probably should have just played that first but Everything's Gucci. And. Hmm. That's a. Uh, that's an interesting one. Alright, so now we'll play the Sulfur Falls, as we should have last turn. And we'll just get an R set going. Probably we'll die from like a lightning strike or something afterwards, and that's fine. Okay, this is. Okay. There's a lot we can get. If we're trying to go for like the Ral kill later, we'll grab another expansion. Because now, Shock. Expansion, it's yeah, the combo's there. Now we can do it. But I have a feeling that we'll have a, well, we, hopefully we have a little bit tougher of a time. Jund, I, hmm. Ha ha ha, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I've seen this one. I've seen this one. This is, ooh. Hone your prowess. I think we could search. We want to shock this so he can't draw cards, but um, guess we're not gonna be able to hold it. Yeah, I guess we just play the guild gate now, and then we also play surfers counter. But yes, so this is a deck that I've seen Magua Mega Magua out. I actually don't know how to link creators. Um, if I figure out how to put like people's title on the screen, I'm gonna put up his channel. He did this deck and. It was a great deck, and I'm guessing that's why this guy's playing it. But this 100% is this Ilharg reanimator deck. And, god damn it. So Bond of Revival is going to be rough on us. But... Yeah, we can't play Ralph. I think Bond of Revival is just too rough on us. I'm actually happy I watched this video now. <laughs> or I wouldn't know what the hell is going on. Yeah, uh, if we played Ral and waited for another spell to just get the expansion explosion off, he could play Bond of Revival and use uh, Galta to just kill whichever plane walker he wants, which is almost surely going to be Ral. Even if he's at 6 power or uh, 6 loyalty, he'll die. Yeah, and this is uh. This is more or less what we expected. No blocks. We still got a 4-4 dragon on the field though, which is good. Now, I think we're going to have to... Hmm. It is a spell. If we're going to try to go for the Rao combo kill, we're going to need it. Hmm. Tough call. Tough call. Alright, we'll keep it. We'll, um, we'll play this untapped. Best get the two life. Um... We'll play Ral, and we just gotta hope. Hopefully, if he doesn't kill Ral, storms are like a symphony. If he doesn't kill Ral, then we can win next turn just by comboing off. This might have been <laughs> that attack might be a little aggressive, but that's fine. 
I don't think we'll ever block in Galta. And if he has another Bond or Revival, then we're an issue. Ah, shoot. We're not going to be able to do the combo, but... I mean, we, we genuinely cannot pass this up. Like, there's no way to not bedevil him. Yeah, plus, obviously, he kills that one anyway. What was that? I'm sorry. Right. That was a lapse in judgment. Of course, we're going to use it there. And that one we toss away. And we're close to flipping it now. The question is, do we play this Narset? I think we do. Let's get these. Let's get this last card in the graveyard. But I anticipate it works too. Mm. I have practiced against many foes Ooh. like you. Meditate mm. and prepare. Mm. Do we just do more damage? Cause we can hit him for six to the dome with Rao's outburst plus expansion explosion. But having two cards to filter with, I think, is more important. So the expansion explosion can just, if we get like a land, then it can just hit for three and draw us three cards. Ritual set. Alright, that makes sense. I think I did see that in that deck list you stole. <laughs> I shouldn't even be saying that because obviously I want people to use my decks eventually too. <laughs> Yeah, there's really no spite or hard feelings in that saying that it's just like it's crazy because now I know what I'm playing against. Um Shahili, that's good. Transform, seven cards, perfect. Let's just use Sahili, then Ral. Um Yeah, so we get that blocker. I don't think it's gonna stop anything. I mean, I know the Palaka worms in the deck, but if he has another bond of revival then I can't imagine it not hitting Galta. Every problem has a a miss, that, that stings. <laughs> and then, yeah, let's, uh, let's grind. Let's, let's look for that other expansion and close out this game. Spell Pierce isn't going to help you out. He's got, interesting. <sighs> yeah, he's got seven lands. Bond of Revival is five. I, yeah, I can't see anything else that he could have that will get a Spell Pierce. Alright, man. Shoot. I'll take it. Alright. Another good hand. We got the one drops. That's all it is. The question is, do we take two life to hold up Opt and Shock? Yeah, we're going to play this one tapped. I... Hmm. Yeah, yeah. It makes the most sense. Yeah, especially against Mono Red. And now we use one of them, then drop Sahili, hopefully on empty board. It really depends on what they play. This is a lot different than I thought. But we have the shock, so it doesn't matter. Now we now we're we're in the driver's seat. I'm guessing our Sahili could get bedeviled or something, but hopefully not. Hopefully we find a way to just um Sahili now opt later and everything works out gravy yeah these three drop planeswalkers are just so powerful they're so powerful <laughs> yeah, let's see how aggressive are you are you going for oh, oh yeah, Sahili alright Sahili good job alright well now that he's just gonna be aggressive I think we shouldn't have taken that two life. Look at him go oops like a jerk. You know what? I'm happy we took the two life. We're going to do both ops and anticipate. We're just going to get a ton of stuff on the board. Please, swing in, my friend. Swing. Go for it. It's all you. You got it. What could I possibly have? Look at him, bro. He's like, oops. And then he's thinking about what to do. Hurry up. <laughs> Good attack. He's definitely got some burn spells. So, this is definitely going to be the point that we just go all in. 
use. Ooh, that's pretty good. But we don't really need it. We take it anyway. Yeah. If he's got a way to kill it, then I'll let him use burn on this 1 1. <laughs> sure. That's pretty good. Now, because of that, maybe we want to land here? But we also have Narset Op next turn. Yeah, we'll take the land. Hmm. Yeah. Hit me. Light up the stage, probably. Drill bit. Interesting. Well, doesn't matter what he takes. It's probably going to be Narset, but Ral is the tougher one. That's the one that's going to close out this game. It would be a heads up move if he takes Ral. He takes Ral. All right, man. Way well, not to conform to society. A lot of people would not be doing that. Either way, I don't think that he has a way out of this. Chain Whirler is devastating. My prowess is unmatched by my peers. But it is what it is. We're also not going to use Narset's ability. I did that pretty quickly without kind of giving the heads up, but risk factor, now he really can't use it. Like, go ahead and draw. This one's a little annoying, can't lie. But we'll opt. Do we opt? If we opt and get something like Sarkin, I'm actually going to be a little tight, but I think we opt here. He gets Sarkin. You know what? We'll let Sarkin go. He has to take Sarkin. You know? And I can find a burn spell. But now it's like I can stop his burn spell. But he has to take Sarkin. Definitely should have done that the other way, but it is what it is. Let's see. So we have six in the graveyard. So if we toss the next card, we'll be cool. And I hmm, four is gonna hit for three. If we don't do it next turn, it's four, then three, then two. Yeah, we're just swinging in. Yeah, I, I didn't want to do the full numbers in my head, but it's just yeah, he blocks one, so what? Still taking three damage. We gotta get in that kill, baby. Dang, man. I love the soul ring back. It's so nice. Really? Face? Does he have light at the stage? Another drill bit? Face? If he plays drill bit, then I just use spell pierce. And then what's going to happen? You have to pay the two or... I guess you don't have to pay the two. Which makes the most sense. Yeah, you don't pay the two, and then you do a risk factor after. But is this hand that trash? Either way, we use a spell, so it definitely is our benefit. No. What? Why would you pay the two? Yo, gold rank, huh? I mean, I'm in gold rank, so I can't talk trash. But like, that's obviously not the right move, right? You don't get anything now, and. Could have used Risk Factor, could have had mana to use both of those things. Absolutely should have hit um, Narset last turn. And now that's the game. We shock the Kite Sail. Get Sarkin, plus it, swing in. Yeah, that just... That was an ill-advised turn. Do you? I summon you! Just the trick for this. Right, let's just take another Sarkin. Just in case some wild shit happens. Mm, I respect. Kill yourself, I respect it. Alright, again, another good hand. This is just always what you want the hands to be. The one mana drops are... So good against just about everything. Shock and spell curse. I just 
I have no worries in my heart. I don't know what he's playing, but I'm confident that I will do fine. Because that's the best thing about the deck. It just has so much natural filtering. So instead of having just absurdly powerful cards, I just find what I need and I'll let the Planeswalkers do all the work. Sahili, hopefully we don't even have to play our stuff too much. We can just do Anticipate into Sahili now. I doubt it, but that's what I'm hoping for. And it looks like we're doing, um, hmm. I was gonna say Sultai Golgari, but Sultai Golgari doesn't usually play. They don't usually play that, do they? Either way, I think now we'll drop this Sahili and we'll start looking for land next turn. Well, there goes yeah, Steam Deck, so whatever. But either way, yeah. Should be straight. This should be fun. Yeah, we can literally drop this land, play everything in our hand. Ooh. Oh, Dev. I don't know what I'm playing against, to be honest. We'll drop this land. We just want. Ooh, that is um, decisions to be made. I think we gotta kill Davriel, but. Good luck with your little duel. Alright, opponent's turn. Alright, this isn't Sultai. It's just strictly Golgari, which uh I respect. That is uh not a powerful turn. We can't take another mountain, can we? We'll take another anticipate maybe. Rao, we also could just drop and then start scrying. Hmm. Nope, but we got what we need. So now we search and hold up Pierce. I'm thinking he's got to be playing like Big Vraska. There's got to be something in this deck that really is pushing it to do what, whatever his goal is. I, I honestly don't know. Hmm. The discard is going to help search now, though, if he plays like another Davriel. He doesn't. Really? Is he just playing like Golgari Command the Dreadhorde? Side note, Spell Pierce is of course amazing against that card. Massacre Girl, okay. Whoops. I'm an idiot. I uh That was a dumb move. We're going to take Eugene because we're going to need to make up for that stupid move. Yeah, we could have just had another... We'll have to keep that on top, too. Yeah. Let's try to get this land. Good, good, good. Alright, so Sahili's at 5, luckily. Yeah, he's looking at it. Or they're looking at it. She's looking at it. I shouldn't be sexist. They're looking at it. But hopefully we can pop off this spell pierce on something good. And then just use Cease Eugene this. to ride away to the victory. Alright, Karn. We can spell pierce that, so we will. We'll get this second body that can block so it keeps the Healy alive. But really, what we're looking for is... We'll graveyard that to transform it. Eugene coming into play. And is it Guildgate? Ugh. I don't know, something about this deck just fulfills my OCD, like, it just always hits on point. And we'll play as a guild gate. We're not gonna kill Master Girl, because now we don't have to. We can toss three blockers in the way and just let them take care of it. There's the Wild Growth Walker. And the Murph Prince Walker, my man was saving things. I don't know what he is, but it's gotta be just Golgari. Command the Dread Horde, something, something. Well, fantastic. Let's just get these blocks in. We're gonna need some spells, but I mean, off the draw and search for his content, we should get something. The question is with Eugene, or do we. Oh, forget it. This is. We can get four cards off Expansion Explosion. But we don't even have to do it now. Ugh. This is lovely. Of the yeah, we're just going to pass and uh, hopefully he attacks with everything. And we can just kill Wild Growth Walker. And we'll be straight. You know what I'm thinking about having in this deck too? Narset's Reversal, right? 
and then hitting command the dread horde with it imagine that oh my god it would be so lovely all right so what is he doing both at eugene as expected once again narset playing in work God, this is just it feels uh, this deck feels too good sometimes yeah now three things uh yeah and just naturally getting three more of these blockers oh sahili sahili why are you so good and that is a terrible follow-up no cards left in hand yeah this is game we're going to play narset get something then we play Rao, Stry. So he doesn't care anymore. Done. 